from a young age i'd already decided what i wanted in terms of trajectory of getting married and having a family my favorite show for years was say yes to the dress i just love seeing the whole process of picking out wedding dresses and all of that i've always said myself from when i was younger literally i need to have had a child by the time i'm 30 otherwise i'm having no kids at all do i know that the gen that i'm part of gen z is very different and it's going to be hard to attain that yes but with the lord anything is possible i literally have to ha be married by 24 i have, to have my first child by 25 and my last child by the time i'm 30 that is the order and it's not switching up if i do not if i haven't had a child by the time i'm 30 i'm not having any at all i refuse to be an old mum. that's not the life for me i don't want to be 40 something years old and having to drop my child to and from school like huh like no if it's my youngest child still being young then yeah cool but my oldest child needs to be a teenager when i'm in my 40s like and also i want to be able to have kids and my parents are still young enough to be able to like you know look after them all of that i don't want my parents to be like elderly by the time i have children like that's just rubbish and i know society trying to push this thing on women now saying oh you don't need to have kids young you don't need to get married live your best life this and that yeah 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 whatever you feminists can come and say you want to live your best life and this and that and you don't want to be a mother and you don't want to do this me i want to have children i want to get married like call me whatever i don't care i know what i want and I will still try to get it even though I'm in a generation where it's like, you know, it's a bit, it's a bit harder to do so. And I just don't really like how like nowadays, if like a female and a guy like get married at like a younger age, like say 20, 21, 22, 19, people was just bashing them saying, oh, you're too young, this or that. Like you shouldn't be getting married at this age, you shouldn't be this or that. But then people will praise people for being a teen parent. And it's like, why are you praising people for being a teen parent but then you're bashing people for getting married at a young age like it doesn't really make sense to me a lot of females dream about the wedding dream about the dress like say yes to the dress show the decor the celebration behind it is what really hooks these type of females it's not the actual value behind marriage and the family behind marriage it's never really to do with that marriage to them is more of an outfit a fashion trend that a trend that they want to join at least once in their life say they did it they had it and can show it off here and there because if we really listen to what she's saying it's nothing to do with why she wants to be a wife it's all about the wedding and having children it's not really centered around the value behind marriage and what she can offer and what it means to her and what it means to be a wife this is where they don't see you have already failed yourself as a gen z in your prime years because she hasn't hit 35 yet so time isn't the issue here it's her mindset nothing about being in one generation or the other will make marriage less attainable that always comes down to you what her prioritizing and what she wants and this female doesn't actually want what she says she wants saying you want this without actually doing it is really words with no actions meaning everything she's saying actually means nothing so my overall point is, it don't matter what she wants. If she isn't prioritizing being a traditional wife first before anything else and sustaining her purity right now as we speak, then she can talk about all the weddings and children she wants until she's 45. But she'll still end up being unmarried, childless or a single mom. I'm your hostess, Reminent Princess. These are my last thoughts. A lot of females think talking about what you want automatically means you're going to get what you want without putting any type of work, without even cultivating the type of person you need to be to get those things. And this is where a lot of females they end up hitting the wall later on in life because you do a lot of talking but your actions don't actually replicate anything that you say you want 
You say you want to be a wife, but you're living like a three or four. You say you want to be a wife, but you're dressing like a baddie. You know, and that's what a lot of these females are doing. Let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.